Getting reports, all force fields down. Civilians taking to the streets in droves. Cerberus pulling back. That won't last. The people don't have the training to go up against Cerberus front lines. They'll be wiped out. Civilian casualties can't be avoided. You'll have to accept this. Say what you will, Arya. I won't allow senseless deaths. Do what you can to protect them. Of course, Commander. Arya, bring here. Report. My team is scouting the maintenance tunnels. We've encountered Cerberus forces escorting engineers. They're moving gear. Look to be sending explosives to the station's central support columns. Bray, engage. Delay them as long as you can. We're coming. Got it. Roll out, people. If they detonate the main column, they'll cut off the way to afterlife. The Talon offensive will be stopped cold. So we split up? Yes. Nyreen, lead the frontal assault. Shepard and I will meet you in the markets after we've taken care of those bombs. Of course. But don't count on me building your memorials if you get yourselves killed. Don't get ahead of yourself. The only route to the central column is through the tunnels. before Cerberus sets off those bombs. Once the access panels were 
Things are under control here. What's your situation? We're advancing to the Gozu district. Move forward. Keep that flank covered. Yes, boss. We're holding our own, but Cerberus has started targeting the civilians. Reports of casualties are coming in from all sectors. Just get to the rendezvous point. That's all that matters. Not in my world. Nyrene out. So how exactly do we get to afterlife from here? I'm thinking the straightforward approach for a change. Looks like they bit off more than they could chew. We should get a move on. Phase of the project on schedule. 
Before host conversion, we should begin the process of fusing the control implants to the subject's nervous systems. With the current success ratio, we project being able to surpass demand by 300%. The first generation adjutants have been transferred from the containment area and are being outfitted with the implants. The previous batches have been processed and moved to the storage area. We can now control when and where the adjutants convert their victims. Initial testing on various species provides ample proof the virus can adapt flawlessly, regardless of the host used. Those idiots were experimenting on adjutants. That explains the ones we saw earlier. Extra security. The doors only open one at a time. Makes sense, considering what they had locked up in here. The door's unlocked. Let's get out of here. That doorway leads to the Gozu district. This looks familiar. I liked it better when Morden Solis was here shooting up looters. Morden is dead. Pity. He was a very practical kind of Solarian. Take out the turret! Is that the Roman scout having a 
chest earlier, I'd be dead. Cerberus is still on my station. Of course something's not right. Not what I was talking about. I'm checking this out. Going radio silent. What the hell is she doing? Where's Nyrene? Scouting ahead. We've got our hands full holding this area. She's going on to afterlife. Irene Kandros was a good soldier. It's a shame she had to die for your petty ambitions. You're a dead man! No, wait! <laughs> what now, Petrovsky? Divide and conquer, Commander. Kandros killed the adjutants we hadn't finished experimenting on. These are fully under our control. The protocols for our future army. Hold the perimeter. Keep Shepard away from those generators.
surrender. Cease and desist all aggression. It's over. Commander Shepard, I surrender myself into your custody. That is the most pathetic thing I've ever heard. <coughs> Shepard, I'm unarmed, and I can give the Alliance intel on the elusive man. You'll say anything to save your skin. I, I let you escape, Omega. I deserve mercy. Is this true, Arya? Inexplicably. I think he'd agree now that it was the biggest mistake of his life. But this is murder. That's right. Cold, blooded murder. No less than you deserve. Clean up this mess. Well, that was deeply satisfying. I'm a little surprised. I thought you might try to interfere. Why is that? This partnership has been an exercise in frustration. We won. Yes, I know. But I like to know what makes people tick. Especially someone I might need something from in the future. So come clean. Have you been trying to work me? Validating me one minute, judging me the next? Which is it, really? Have I been that hard to read? I've lived for a thousand years, Shepard, and you may be the most powerful and baffling being I've ever encountered. I have no idea where I stand with you. I like it better that you don't know. I'd hate to see you get too comfortable. You are a truly dangerous person. And don't worry, I honor my debts. You'll have all the troops, ships, and Ezo that I promised. Then I'll be going. Bray will take you back. I have a station to whip into shape. Citizens of Omega, hear me. I, Arya Talok, have given you back your lives. My rule is reignited. My hand is on the controls once more, and I will not let go again. Each of you owes a debt. Gain my favor by rounding up the remaining Cerberus invaders and... ...and we'll take our revenge. It's their turn to tremble. Their turn to bleed. Going forward, your lives will be hard. But the price you pay is for your freedom. Only I can protect that. And hear this. I will make Omega impenetrable. No one will ever threaten my domain again. From this day on, the galaxy will know one hard truth. Don't fuck with Omega. You always get these crap details, Bray? Not this time. You got a galaxy to save. Let's get you off this rock. 